Hi, this is Mike Donahue from Flying Buttress, and this is Two Minutes with Mike. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make a normal Outlook meeting request a Teams meeting. So to do this, you have to have both Outlook and Teams installed on your computer. You can install these apps on your home personal computer as well. They don't require a license key. Um, both are available from office.com. Um, so to do this, the quickest way i found is just to hop into your calendar and Outlook like normal, uh, right-click on the time you want the meeting, select New Meeting Request, like you normally would. Uh, pretend it's just a traditional meeting. Um, so this is going to be Mike's meeting, and I'm going to invite myself because I'm lonely. And in the once I click in the body here, I click on this Teams meeting button, if you don't see this Teams meeting button, uh, it means that you may have to launch Teams before you launch Outlook uh, when you start up in the morning. Um, so try exiting out of Outlook uh, while Teams is running and then reloading Outlook and see if this button appears. So I click that button and automatically it's made into a Teams meeting. All the information that someone either inside or outside of your company needs is right here. If you have the add-on for audio conferencing, um, it'll also show the phone number and the conference ID um, so that people who are just calling in from their phones can join as well. You hit send and off it goes. And that's the easiest way. There's several, but that's the easiest way I've found to create a Teams meeting. Again, once you go in, you can copy, paste, this information and send it to whomever you like. Thank you.